Hi there and welcome to this lesson. Let's dive into something cool today. The complex realm of company operations, but in a way that it's easy to get. We're talking about two concepts that often lead the industry of procurement, the value chain and the supply chain. At the end of this lesson, you will be able to distinguish between the value chain and the supply chain concepts in company operations to emphasize their respective roles and purposes in order to ensure the efficient acquisition of resources and materials. Gain insight into how the supply chain operates as a network of production flow, from sourcing raw materials to delivering the final product to the customer in order to optimize your procurement process. Recognize how procurement can influence primary and support activities, such as sourcing high quality materials, fostering innovation through supplier relationships and improving efficiency in logistics. While intertwined in their roles within the company, they serve distinct functions in the progression of goods and services from conception to consumption. First up, the value chain as described by Michael Porter. The value chain depicts the full spectrum of activities that add value to a company offerings. Conversely, the supply chain focuses on the sequence of processes involved in the production and distribution of goods. Understanding the distinctions and the relationship between those two chains is crucial for companies and procurement professionals aiming to fine tune their operation and achieve market superiority. The value chain framework helps break down the steps the company takes to deliver a product or service. According to Porter, it is composed of primary and support activities that work hand in hand to create value for customers. Primary activities include inbound logistics, operations, outbound logistics, marketing and sales and service, all direct functions contributing to the production and delivery of goods and services. Support activities procurement, technology development, human resource management and firm infrastructure provide the essential foundation and assistance necessary for the primary activities to operate effectively. Each of these steps represents a potential source of competitive advantage, whether through cost leadership or differentiation. In contrast to the value chain, the supply chain is the network that involves the production flow of goods, from raw materials to the final products in the hands of the consumer. It is an interconnected web of entities, including suppliers, manufacturers, retailers, and ultimately customers. The supply chain's primary focus is on the logistical aspects of production, such as transportation, warehousing, and inventory management. It aims to optimize the entire process to ensure that products are moved in the most efficient, cost-effective manner. This involves strategic planning to manage and mitigate risks, synchronize supply with demand and reduce overheads. Effective supply chain management is critical for minimizing costs and meeting customer demands promptly, which in turn influences the company's ability to compete in the marketplace. The value chain and supply chain are distinct yet interconnected frameworks used to examine different aspects of our company's operations. The value chain is concerned with the incremental addition of value to raw materials through each step of production and delivery processes, accumulating in the final product or service. It looks over every action within a company that contributes to the final output. In contrast, the supply chain is a broader term about the entire journey of a product from raw material sourcing to final delivery to the consumer. It involves a network of suppliers, manufacturers and distributors focusing on the flow and transformation of goods. The difference between these two lies in their orientation. The value chain is inward looking, centered on internal company processes and how to add value within them. The supply chain is outward looking, focusing on how to move goods and services through different companies and to the end user as efficiently as possible. The supply chain prioritizes the delivery of that value through effective logistics and operations management. However, the two chains are not mutually exclusive. 
a well-managed supply chain can enhance the value chain by reducing costs, improving quality and ensuring timely delivery. Similarly, a strong value chain with its focus on creating high value products can make a supply chain more effective by increasing demand and customer satisfaction. Understanding the difference and relationships between the value and the supply chain is vital for companies and procurement professionals like us. It allows us to not only streamline our operations, but also to identify where we can create the most value. A cool example, look at Amazon. The principles of the value chain and supply chain are exemplified by them. Amazon's supply chain mastery is evident in its seamless coordination from suppliers to customer delivery, optimizing each step for speed and efficiency. This includes innovation in warehousing, inventory management and delivery logistics that ensure products are available and delivered in a good and efficient manner. On the other hand, Amazon's value chain is enhanced by its customer-centric approach, offering a wide range of products, ease of online shopping and additional services like Prime membership, which adds value through convenience, speed and entertainment. To better explore it, we're going to go more into detail about Amazon's value chain in the next lesson. For now, the interplay between Amazon's value chain and supply chain underlines a critical company insight. The integration and optimization of both chains are crucial for delivering customer satisfaction. For companies, this interdependence means that strategic investment in both areas is not just beneficial, but essential. The supply chain ensures products reach the market effectively, while the value chain ensures that these products are desirable and valuable to customers. In summary, the value chain and supply chain are two fundamental concepts in any company strategy that, while related, serve different purposes. Total control and overview of the value chain focuses on adding value within a company, whereas the supply chain orchestrates the flow of goods from suppliers to customers across multiple organizations. Here's a template for you. At the bottom are listed activities for either value chain or supply chain. Apply what you have learned in this lesson and put the activities to which chain they belong. Before ending the lesson, let's have a quick recap of what you've learned here. The value chain adds value within a company to gain a competitive edge, while the supply chain orchestrates the flow of goods from suppliers to customers across multiple organizations. To recognize and leverage each unique role can lead to unparalleled efficiency, customer satisfaction and profitability. That's it for now. We hope to see you in the next lesson.